Ryan Murphy has won his first ever individual world's title in the 200 backstroke today. For as long as Murphy's been around and the extreme level of success he's seen in the sport, it sounds very weird to say this is his first ever individual world title. And why is that? My favorite explanation is that Murphy typically performs better in even number years and worlds are normally held in odd number years. Don't believe me? In 2016, Murphy was a double Olympic champion in the 100 and 200 back as well as set a world record in the 100 back leading off USA's gold medal winning medley relay even year. In 2017, Murphy won a silver medal in the 200 back and a bronze medal in the 100 back as well as losing out to Matt Grievers for medley relay duties that year. Odd year. In 2018, Murphy won Pampax Gold in the 100 and 200 back while setting meet records and coming within hundreds of his Rio winning times. He also did another dip under 52 seconds in the 100 back. Even year. In 2019, Murphy won a silver medal in the 200 back and finished 1 one hundredth outside of the medals in the 100 back with a 4th place finish. Odd year. In 2020, never mind, that was a bad year for everyone, let's just skip this one. In 2021, at the Tokyo Olympics, Murphy went to silver in the 200 back and bronze in the 100 back. That was an odd year, but I will say he did earn another world record, leading off Team USA's medley relay. I'm just going to say that the whole odd year curse got confused by the fact the meet was still called the 2020 Tokyo Olympics. Joking aside, huge congratulations to Ryan Murphy for winning the 200 backstroke today, as well as getting under 52 seconds yet again in the 100 back just a couple days ago. I guess I'm just so excited that 